Hello there, only one Kenobi here, only one. Don't get excited, I haven't got him open yet. That's the original version of the figure. I thought I'd bring it along, why not? Compare it to this. This is director Orson Krennic, and it's a VC302, there you go. Um, haven't opened it yet, as I say. I just thought I would just give you a quick glimpse at the other one. But look at him, he's a great figure, and what worries me though about this thing I'm about to open is it hasn't... <laughs> It's not going to be that much different, really. They've obviously got a different head sculpt, articulation of the arms. They've got this beautiful new imperial mould. But what I was sad about was the fact that the the cape is, is hard goods again. I thought they could have come up with something else. They could have maybe got something around the shoulders that was hard or firm and then had some of that lovely draping robe that they've had for... Yeah, look at him. I think they could have done a white one of them for Krennic, couldn't they? You know, I'm not sure, man. I... This is a better fabric than they've ever done before. And inside, it's got a, almost like a felty kind of finish. So it gives it a bit of weight and it's flimsy and it falls nicely. I think they could have done that for Krennic. I wish they'd done that. I think they should have, but they didn't. The moulds are different as well for the cape. This looks a little shorter than this is longer. Anyway, can't make a decision until I get the thing open, but I will say this before I open it. I'm a big fan of that car back image because myself and others have been dreaming or speculating what they would do for a car back for Orson Krennic. There were always a couple of different options. You've got the iconic image when he stood by the targeting computer of the Death Star, I believe that is. This is an image that I'd never seen before. And it's a good one. I love that moment. I think he's at the top of the tower there. Oh, I have, have I? You've lost. You know that bit? The shield is up. I love the way he talks. I lose nothing but time. It's just like pure anger or something in his voice. Look at that image. It's really nice. <sighs> Let me just blow the dust off it. Um, I like it a lot. He was great in it. I thought he was excellent in it. My God, I'll say this to start with. Look at that. There's, um, well, looks like the only thing they've done is given it some brown paint for the handle. It's like grey plastic, whereas that is silver. I don't know, the gun on this, the gun on this looks better. Better. Let's have a look at the sculpt of these. They are the set, are they? I do believe that they have, well, the two blasters are different. They, yeah, they are different, well different. But I prefer the silvery one though. It's a bit of sparkle. Let's get on with this. Let's see what he's like. Now, the first thing I want to do is get him out of that hard goods, man, because you can't articulate. I mean, this is an articulated figure. You can't have a hard good cape sign. That's one of the reasons why soft would have been better. I mean, you might be there in the comments and think, well, they couldn't do that. Shut up. You know what I mean? It was hard to do that. But I think they could have done it. Why not? Could have maybe had some hard goods at the top of it there. If they needed some sort of support over the shoulders and then it could have draped down in three sections maybe. You know, two two sides and then the back maybe in three different pieces. See the way that kinks there? You've got this section there. They could have split it up the fabric. I don't know. I'm no tailor. I don't know anything about it. I'm just thinking about how they could have done it logically. But the, anyway, hard goods it is. I'll be very tempted to have this without the cape because I'm sure there's a few scenes where he's not wearing his his cloak but um the figure actually I do like the head sculpt I wasn't sure if I was digging it in the packaging but now I've got him loose yeah it is a good it's a it's definitely an improvement yeah so you know well done Asbro I like that his insignia it was pretty much uh level with Tarkin I think the amount of notches on there but Tarkin has yellow, if that makes any sort of significant difference. Governors have yellow, though. So he's Governor Tarkin, wasn't he? So maybe he's a Grand Moff, but he's got other sort of, you know, notches to his name that put him above the rank of this guy, which is a, a military director. But he's obviously up there, isn't he? Krennic is right up high. He still wants favour of the Emperor. I love that, though. He wants the Emperor's blessing and favour and whatever. He's climbing the ladder, isn't he? Greasy pole. I like him without the bloody cape, man, which is a good thing. But 
It's because I want to, it's just, for me now, just doing this video, it's a novelty to see Kranich with arms that bend, man. I've had this figure since 2016, and this is just great. But if I put that on it, man, oh, God. Nah, 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 Hasbro, why did you give us a hard goods? Pathetic. That is just such a cop-out. Even if it was just a cape that looked like that, it's probably not as screen accurate. That's got a collar. That's probably got a collar that's white, man. You could have made it white like that. Oh, man. Oh, Johnny, did you back the wrong horse? Did you bloody make the wrong choice? I'm going to put the old cape on this one and see what that looks like. God, I mean, that's even... It goes across. It gives it a bit more space to maneuver. I don't know, man. Do you know what? Let's just put, we can put this old, this new one on this old one. Oh, no, that doesn't work. <laughs> it's pathetic. Again, like I'm saying, I'd be quite tempted just to um, have him like that. Stood with the Death Troopers. I'm sure he was running around at the end without his cape on. But then again, he's wearing his cape there. And that looks like it's the final scene on the top of the tower. Let me know what you think. What are the peg holes like? God, God help us. He's got rocker ankles as well, so we're, we're, uh, July through November, we're asking for, for trouble here, man. Look at that. Look at this, man. That's a really deep peg hole, isn't it? I don't think so. And now he is rotating, so we'll give him a spin so you can see him, so you can see him from all angles. I'm still made up with the figure. I'm still made up with the fact that we have him officially now. About time, man. It's crazy that, you know, they didn't do him before now. But one could argue that that was all part of their strategy to whet the appetite, you know, of, a, of, of the fan base. You know, he's a popular character. You like Dooku, you know. It's like, where's Dooku? Where are these key villains? And now at least we have this guy. I do not like him looking like that. I think it's awful. Do not like it with that hard goods cape on him, man, with these arms that so are desperate to move out beyond that prison that is that rubber cape he looks good the cape looks great and everything but i've seen it before i've seen it for the last seven to eight years man with this so i'm taking it off actually i'm taking it off and do you know what for the thumbnail i'm gonna have him without it i'm gonna pose him again might get the blaster in his hand, actually. Then we're going to say goodbye. All right, I've brought a couple of figures through here <laughs> for a bit of fun, right? So what I've brought through is I've brought... I brought Wolfie Laren because I want to see what he looks like wearing the cape. Let's do that first. I went through to get her. Because she's got a black hat. But then when I was through there, I spotted this guy who was in that four-pack set. And he's also got a black hat. I want to see what he looks like with a black hat on. Because he does wear one quite a lot. He wears one at Edu. Or on Edu. Which is the facility where Galen Erso has his uh, team. He also has one at the very beginning. It's lonely, I should imagine. But farming? Really? Man of your talents? That does not fit him. <laughs> oh, God. This probably will. Let's try this one here. Um, well, you know, I've seen a lot worse. Wow, I can still see a bit of Rogue One action. It's a bit big for his head, but I'm feeling a Rogue One vibe there. And then that is it. But you know what? Let's see if we can put this on to um, Wolfie Laren. I don't particularly want to because Wolfie Laren didn't wear one of these. God, I keep picking up the wrong one. They're so similar, these capes. This is the one from the vintage collection. Look at that, man. That's awesome. That'd be good for some Instagram shots, though, wouldn't it? Look at that. How cool does he look? Do you know what? I might give that to him. He looks awesome. Look at that. It fits in perfectly as well. I love that. This one will probably also fit him. But it's because this has got quite broad, it's got broad shoulders on this one. I've never tried this before. No, 
No, that doesn't work as well. Oh, it does actually. Well, like a Dooku vibe there. Yeah, that one works as well. I'll tell you what then, so we're going to put that one on him. Does this one work on this 5 POA? Should do. Yeah, either or really. I've got that like that. I love that. That's quite cool. You could, do you know what, man? That's a f Instagram thing. You could have that. You could have Krennic and Yolarin having a stroll. There's some great toy photographers out there and they do stuff like that. They mash stuff up, man. It's great, great, great ideas. So this cape I'm now putting on Yolarin is this one from the TVC. That works all right. And now I'll just put this one back on here. God, this is supposed to be a review of the new t <laughs> the new Krennic, but it's becoming a bit of a mashup, but who cares? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna leave it there. And that is it. That's my little Krennic review. Been all over the place. It's long again, man. I'm gonna to have to cut that down, but the Revan video was long as well, as you remember. But still, I hope you've enjoyed it all the same. This has been only one Kenobi, only one, out.